Hello friends. In today's class, we are going to talk about sentential form, which is nothing but an intermediate representation of derivation. Welcome here and uh, the next topic that we are discussing here is the sentential form. So here uh, the definition is uh, given is S derives alpha. Okay, so uh, we are okay. So S derive alpha, or let's say let's say A S derive A, where A may contains the non-terminal. Then we say that A is the senten sentential form of G. It is the intermediate representation of three. Okay, so now here. Uh, here s derives alpha and alpha may contain the non-terminal so basically what it is trying to say here that if i take a grammar s derive a double a s b or a b and if i try to derive a string where double a let's say s b and one more time double a four times a s double b now and finally let's say one, two, three, four, five, and triple B. <clears throat> so here, uh, here, these all intermediate representation. Okay, these all intermediate representations are known as your sentential form. So sentential form is nothing but the best way to describe this intermediate uh, intermediate representation of tree or intermediate representation. intermediate representation of derivation okay a sentence is a sentential form with no non terminal in our case uh, when we are talking about very formal language in that case sentence will be nothing but the string so string because we don't derive the sentence right now we are not deriving sentence so a string uh, with no non-terminals okay string with no non-terminals is termed as the sentential form 